Jimmy Thang from Maximum DC here at Alien Wars booth at E3 2013, and I'm here with uh, Eddie. Yeah. So Eddie, what are we taking a look at here right now? So this is the Alien Wars 17. Um, it's definitely the system that you want to get if you're looking for immersion and superior technology. So we've we've introduced the system with the Fortune Intel Core i7 processors and NVIDIA GeForce 700 series graphics. Um, when it comes to gaming, graphics is critical. So we start the system off with a GeForce 765M graphics card. But that's also, um, you can also upgrade that to a 770 or a 780M as well. All of them use GDDR5 graphics. Um, on the processor side, you can go all the way from a 4700 to an Intel uh, Core i7 4930X and um, it hauls ass. Um, from a memory side, you can get up to 32 gigs of memory, and you can get up to four hard drives on this system if you opt out of the optical. If you keep your optical, you can get three hard drives, and you can opt to a Blu-ray drive as well. So all the main components have been taken care of. Um, we have a really cool, uh, really cool screen. So it's a 17-inch screen. Um, there's a couple options. One of them includes a full HD anti-glare uh, finish. The other one is a 3D 120 hertz stereoscopic screen that is actually a true life screen, so that one has a little more gloss. Um, but, um, very vivid screen, very big screen. Uh, we know a lot of our gamers really like to have a large screen that they can use so they can see the whole game and really draw in that, that immersion that they want. Um, as you can see, this one also has the same, uh, the same design that we saw with the 14 earlier and we'll see with the 18 later on. From a ports perspective, it's got all the major critical ports and you'll see that they've all been lined up very well in the center of the side of the, of the system. Even the audio ports kind of stick out. We do have to make sure that any peripheral or any headphone or any audio, any device that you buy, is gonna have enough clearance to plug in properly and work the way it should. Looking on the inside, you notice there's a lot of uh, really cool stuff. We're, we're showing Alienware Command Center right now, and we're in the Alien Effects module. So what Alien Effects lets you do, it lets you take control of the different lighting zones, and lets you customize them the way you want them. So for example, if we wanted to change uh, the Alienware logo to, to a blue color, right? So we wanted to change to a blue, we can hit apply right away. Right away we can save, we can save a brand new theme um, and keep it. Okay. So change. It's probably quick change too. Right? So you'll notice it's blue on the, on the GUI, it's also blue on the actual hardware. We can do even more things, right? So we can have... We can have, instead of it going blue, we can have it morph from blue to red. And once we hit apply, you'll see that that change will start happening. It'll start morphing from blue to red, and it, it'll loop. It'll loop. So beyond that, um, we can we can do that. We can do that to all the different zones. Can you do it to the trackpad as well? The, so the trackpad can change its solid color, um, but it cannot actually go it can't do the, the advanced the advanced effects so right now we have it in blue I just changed it to blue right here but we have 10 different zones all together and within each zone you could actually create a whole uh, a whole series a whole sequence of actions so let's say that you wanted let's see zone 2 is the right side the numpad right right now it's green I could I could add a sequence that will actually hang on I could add a sequence that will look pink Right? Is that okay? Or actually, I can add, let's add a blue one. So it's blue, then pink. Um, and I can keep on, on, and on, and on, and on. These are just solids. But I can change these to morph. For example, let's say I want it to begin as pink, but then to morph into blue. That'll give me a really cool transition as I go to the next one. Then I can actually change this one to morph from blue to, I don't know, let's say yellow. But let's flip that, let's flip that. Let's have blue on the left and yellow on the right. Right? Hit OK, now I can apply, and the numpad will change. It's very bright in here, so it might be tough to see, but uh, I assure you it's working. <laughs> um, and the price in the late The price of this system? It starts at $14.99. That's a $14.99, that's with the Core i7 4700. Um, that's with the uh, NVIDIA GeForce GTX 765M, 8 gigs of memory, and a 750 gig hard drive. Uh, it launched on Tuesday, that was uh, just this week. So as of this week, we have all three notebooks available worldwide. And we actually also have some, some, uh, some new backpacks available as well. You should check them out. Cool, thank you. Yeah.